Greedy means you want your share and you want everybody else's share too. You don't want to share with anybody. The Greedy Old Fat Man. It was written by Paul Galdone and he drew the pictures too. Once there was a greedy old fat man and he could never get enough to eat. One day he ate 100 biscuits and then he drank a barrel of milk, a huge barrel of milk, but he was still hungry. So he went for a walk and he met a little boy and a little girl. And the little boy said, how come you're so fat? And the greedy old fat man said, well, I ate a hundred biscuits and I drank a barrel of milk. And if I catch you, I'll eat you too. Can you say that with me? If I catch you, I'll eat you too. Well, he chased after that little boy and he chased after the little girl and he caught them and he ate them. Oh. Boom, boom. Could you do that with me? Boom, boom. And he went along until he met a little fox. And the little fox, it looks like a wolf, but it's red like a fox, orange like a fox. He said, the fox said, hey, 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 how come, how come you're so fat? And the greedy old fat man said, well, I ate a hundred biscuits. I drank a barrel of milk. I ate a little boy. I ate a little girl, I ate a little dog, I ate a little cat. And if I catch you, I'll eat you too. No, he has claws. Well, he does have claws. And the greedy old fat man chased after that fox. He didn't catch him yet. He does catch him though. And he ate him. <laughs> Boom. The squirrel said, you can't catch me. And he began to climb the tree. And the greedy old fat man climbed right up behind him. The squirrel climbed higher. Yep. The greedy old fat man climbed higher. The squirrel went out on a limb. The greedy old fat man tried to chase him. And down he fell. Everybody caught him. Ka boom. And when he landed on the ground, out popped the little boy who said, I'm out. Out popped the little girl who said, I'm out. Hey. Out popped the dog who said, Ruff, I'm out. Out popped the cat who said, Meow. I'm, just me. I'm out. Out popped the fox and the rabbits who said, I'm out. And the greedy old fat man was laying behind that tree. Can you see his feet? Everybody was out. I can see his feet back there. And the squirrel said, I'm out because I never got caught. I'm faster than that greedy old fat man. You should have just eaten the squirrel. <laughs> he, everything else is too big. Can you tell me, could you eat a hundred biscuits? No. no. Could you drink a, gar a barrel of milk? No. no. Could you eat a girl? No. Or a boy? No. Or a dog? No. Or a cat? No. How about a fox? No. How about a whole bunch of rabbits? No. Show me what you would look like if you ate all those things. Show me how big you would be. You should be that giant big if you were the greedy old fat. The title of this book is One Duck, Another Duck. 
and it's written by Charlotte Pomerantz. Danny and his grandmother went to the pond. Can you tell what gran uh, Danny and his grandmother is? Owls. Owls, yeah, owls. They saw a mother duck with her baby ducks. You guys see the baby ducks? They were behind her. Danny started to count them. One duck, another duck, Another duck? Is that how you count? No. no. No, said grandmother. You know how to count. That's right. Danny counted. Six ducks, another duck. Seven ducks, another duck. Eight ducks, another duck. Nine ducks. Nine ducks, said Danny. Danny and grandmother. Watch the ducks go by. Another duck, he asked. No, said grandmother, no more ducks. Look, grandma, now there are enough swans to count. Grandmother yawned. Oh, no, 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 Danny, enough counting. It is time to go home. Danny smiled to himself. I know, he thought. I'll count the stars. And he began to count them. Can you guys help me count them? One star, another star, two stars, another star, three stars, another star, four stars, another star, five stars, another star, six stars, another star, seven stars, another star, eight stars, another star, nine stars, another star, ten stars. Great job. The end. <laughs>